To other stories now, the Grand Caddy of uh, the Kwara State Sharia Court of Appeal, Justice Abdul Latif Kamal Din, is asking Muslims to sustain their level of piety even after the holy months of Ramadan. This is just as another Caddy, Justice Abdul Rahim Ahmad Sa'i, says modernity or civilization cannot be divorced from the teachings of the Holy Quran. Correspondent Ibrahim Alege has details. The last 10 days of the holy month of Ramadan usually witness increased supplications to Allah, with some Muslims staying in the mosque throughout the period. This Ramadan lecture by Masalam Islamic Foundation was established by the pioneer chairman of the Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Offenses Commission, ICPC, the late Justice Mustafa Kambi. It couldn't have come at a better time. The whole essence is to remind ourselves of what exactly is our duty on the heart. For instance, like one of the ayahs of the Quran, they have created man not for anything but to worship me. In his lecture, the Grand Cadi of the Quraste Sharia Court of Appeal, Justice Abdul Latif Kamal Din, advises Muslims not to drop the guard of piety even after the Ramadan fast. To be conscious of Almighty Allah, to be pious, and to try to exhibit all the good things that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala commanded the Lord in the Quran to do. And I advise the Ummah to follow and, um, uh, the good legacy left by our father, Honorable Justice Mustafa Khan. At another lecture, a Qadi of the Kwara State Sharia Court of Appeal, Justice Abdul Rahim Hamad Sai, says religion cannot be attributed to any form of backwardness, but rather as a true agent of civilization if properly practiced. Religion cannot be responsible or attributed to any form of uh, backwardness or whatever. So, and uh, we can as well attribute most of the contemporary uh, crisis that humanity is falling into to the deliberate attempt by man to turn their back to the divine teachings as enshrined in the holy books. I speak particularly to the glorious Quran, which is especially my domain. His line of thought was also shared by the acting vice chancellor of the Kwara State University, Malete, Professor Lukman Jima. Whatever you need in terms of saying the institution of modernity is right there in the Quran. But just because people they don't actually understand okay, the intent of the Quran, that's why they feel that they should look elsewhere. And to believe that any demodernization is nothing but supposed to be tailored toward the value of Islam. What Allah you no know, precisely give to us as a way of life. The lecture was organized by the Lauren Emirates Community, Kwara State University, Malite, Ibrahim Alige, TVC News, Lauren.